Today's exercise is all about coordinating your non-dominant hand. For me, I'm a right-handed person, and so I'm going to be working on my left hand here. And essentially what this exercise is designed to work on, and there are many exercises that you should work on and rudiments, but what this exercise is going to work on is accents and small strokes for our left hand. And we're going to do that with some very fundamental knowledge of downstrokes and upstrokes. So what is a downstroke? A downstroke is where the stick starts high and then we go down and we stay down after we strike the drum. So we stay down and we stay at about an inch or two inches above the drum head. All right? I'll show you again. That's a downstroke. An upstroke is where we start right here very low and then we strike the drumstick without lifting up. We're just going to go down and then we're going to come up afterwards. Again, I'll show you. Starting here, down, up. We can only go down just a little bit, so it's not going to be very loud stroke. It's not going to be loud like a downstroke. Right? So that's upstroke. And so today's exercise is just for left hand, and what we're going to do is we're going to do upstroke, downstroke, upstroke, downstroke, up, down. Sometimes we need to just work on our left hand only because our right hand just gets so much more practice. And so sometimes it makes sense to not even touch our right hand and just focus on the left. So I hope this helps you. I hope, I hope it helps you with your non-dominant hand. And I think you're definitely going to find this as your non-dominant hand is usually the hand that plays the snare drum when you play the drum set. So it's going to help you have some cleaner snare drum work. Anyway, take care, practice this, and I'll see you next time.